black reality TV. So I was going to get to this story, but I wanted to let it marinate a little bit. Uh, so future Hall of Famer of the Los Angeles Lakers, Kobe Bryant, uh, gives out a recent uh, things on a podcast or something like that and, and uh, give his thoughts about what he would do if he was still playing in the NBA. And they asked him about what would he do if the national anthem was being played. And he said, Neil. And um, he said some things about Donald Trump as well. Now, I'm going to go against the grain on this one. I know a lot of people are supporting what Kobe Bryant says, but I'm going to call bullshit on this one, and here's why. Back when the whole Trayvon Martin situation uh, went down, Kobe Bryant didn't say shit. He didn't. And when Kobe Bryant was playing, Kobe Bryant, for the most part, took the Michael Jordan approach and shied away from talking about any black issues going on within his community and distanced himself. So, yeah, it sounds good that you, you know, say that what you would do if you were still playing, but... I'm just going to say I don't believe you. I just think you're saying this because it's trendy. You know what I'm saying? And weren't you the same one, Kobe Bryant, that took shots at the black community for uh, defending Trayvon Martin? Yeah, you you were, you were was that same Kobe. Saying that I, I, I wouldn't take up for uh take up for him but just because he's black, we gotta wait till the facts come out and then wanted to uh bash uh the Miami Heat players uh during that time when LeBron James, Dwayne Wade and Chris Bosch and the rest of the team was uh down in South Beach, uh took a picture with the hoodie supporting Trayvon Martin. And you think I'm gonna you think I'm actually gonna believe you that you would take a knee in Let me remind you, you can be, uh, I believe, suspended or fined for kneeling doing the national anthem. So you think I'm going to believe you, Kobe Bryant, that you would sacrifice a game check or be be fined for taking a stance against racial injustice? I don't believe you. It sounds good. You didn't tell people back in 2003, Kobe Brown, when you was going, when you was flying back and forth from Denver, Colorado, back to L.A., when you was going on, when you had that incident with uh, with that woman accused you of rape. You didn't, say, you didn't tell the black community, oh, why are y'all defending me? Let's wait till the facts come out. You didn't say, you didn't say that. So, Kobe Bryant, I appreciate what you said, but it's just lip service as far as I'm concerned. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Black Reality TV.